Alright guys, welcome back to the channel. So today we're going to continue with the uh, US MRE uh, rations that I have. I uh, just bought that fresh cake case like I said the day before. And so today we're going to be checking out uh, menu number one, chili with beans. Um, so yeah, this was the AmeriQuill uh, packaging company. We have a date of... 323rd day of 2020 so very very fresh not very old at all let's go ahead and crack open to this and also just as a reminder guys it's been a while it's been a while since we've done a giveaway and uh i feel it's time so uh keep a lookout it'll be coming soon next couple days so we've got the bag in the bag which in my opinion, always keeps it fresher, and it's also better for the FRH as well. So let's get into this. And chili with beans. Who does not like chili with beans, huh? So here we are. Here's our main chili with beans. We've got a Best Buy, of, or not Best Buy, but manufactured 290th day of 2020. Here is our information card and heater sleeve, chili with beans, 260 calories on this one, uh, 8 ounces as normal, if you'd like to read the ingredients you sure can, and there's your nutrition facts, cheese filled cracker pepperoni pizza flavor, ooh those are new, I've never seen those, nice, okay so calories 240, 1.7 ounce pouch and uh, no date code but nah, that's fine accessory pack let's get into it right on the top moist towelette got ourselves creamer non dairy dry 4 grams so we're going to continue this Bill's Brew I guess he's this built brand is William James Coffee Company has taken over for our coffee. Pack of sugar. Some salt. Iodized. Regular pack of standard gum, which I still haven't tried. So we get ourselves a damp pack of damp climate matches with a white top. And of course, our lighthouse teepee. Hey, ooh, look at this. Cornbread. Now they were thinking. You can't you can't have cornbread without uh without a chili, can we? Heck no. So we got 260 calories on this. Two and a half ounce serving. Alright. Lemon lime flavored no fruit. Beverage based powder. Nice. Alright. 295th day of 2020. It's been a while since I've had uh, the lemon lime flavor. All right, what do we got? We got some cheese spread. Ooh, this one's a little. Well, no, it's okay. One ounces, regular. Just the old regular. And oh, here we go. Vegetable crackers. That's one we haven't had in a while. All right. Still rocking that 2020 date. We got ourselves a standard MRE spoon. Sweet. I was about to say spork, but this is not a Canadian option. Here's our FRH. And for anybody who cares, there's your date code. Which I do care. So, a uh, hot beverage bag, which we are not going to use. Okay. Well, let's see here. I am going to, uh, are they not, I was going to say, are they not putting tear notches on here anymore? They are, it's on, it's on one side. No salt today, I don't see the need. These are fresh rations, so as long as you don't put too much water in, you should be okay.
It's kind of hard to see the line, but I think it's enough. I think I, I put it right on it, right on the line. I actually had to pause the video there for a minute because I didn't think this feeder was going to go. But it took about a, I would say about a good minute. It is going. So. It's gone. It's not as rambunctious as the other one was. And what we'll do is. See if I can get this cornbread back here on the other side of it. I don't think this is going to work, but no, I don't think it's going to work. Sorry about the camera. I'm trying to get this in here. See, I also wanted to shove the cornbread in there, if possible. Yeah, let's see if we can do that. So we got everything stuffed in there. So nobody's going to say, hey, why didn't you put the cornbread in there? Well, we just did, guys. Okay. Let me go grab a couple things and uh, throw this out on a tray. Alright, let's start with the drink. Ooh. That has an odd smell. It does not smell like it usually smells. Matter of fact, it doesn't really smell like much. Okay, there we are. All right, let's get the rest of this out. Got the crackers here. Nice little hiss. Really, it was not wanting to open. Now, let me get this drink out of here. Okay, so the cracker's broken half. I always have such a hard time getting them out. Let's try some of this uh, cheese on here. I'm just going to cut it open. It's easier. Come on here. Cheese looks good. Mm hmm. Cheese filled cracker pepperoni pizza. Flavor. There we go. All right, let's give that ration a couple more minutes. Let's check this out. It's been a good little while. Check out our cornbread first. Ooh, look at that. It smells like cornbread. I don't know if I've had a military cornbread yet. Oh, that heater's still still chugging away. Let's go ahead and 
Let's see if I can get this open. They're really hard to open when they're, they're wet. That pull tab didn't work very well. There we go. There we go. Let's go ahead and throw this out. Smelling good. So, let's not wait any further. Let's try this out. Lots of beans, green chilies. Chili with beans. Okay. Hmm. I taste this chili should. It could probably use a little bit of pepper, maybe a tad salt, but other than that, it's uh, it's not bad. Let's try this cornbread. It's got cornbread consistency for sure. definitely not jiffy but I mean hey for what this is this is not a bad little bad little thing here let me try uh, some of that cornbread with chili now you're talking that's fantastic Oh, that's really good. Now, the vegetable crackers are probably one of my faves. And with that fresh cheese, that's really good. Try some Cholula. We haven't uh, used Cholula in a while. Give it a little bit of heat. Alright, let's try that. Oh yeah, that's good either way, with or without. Overall, this is a really good, good ration. Let's try these, uh, these uh, pizza. It tastes, tastes like pizza. Tastes like the pizza sauce. You taste the cheese. Way better than the standard uh, cheese ones for sure. I don't usually finish my rations. But considering it's something that's a favorite of mine. I'm going to dig in. The cornbread's nice and moist, really fresh. I 
I'm going to be honest, if I buy any more military MREs, I'm going to buy them from this company because so far from what I've seen, they store them really well. It's like one of the freshest cases I've ever opened. Well, I think that's going to do it, guys. Tell me what you think. If you have any questions about where I got this. Or if you'd like the website, let me know. I will probably include it in the description. So, uh, yeah. Thank you for watching. I appreciate it. Keep your eye out for that uh, giveaway video because it's coming. And uh, yeah, guys, until next time, have a good one.